today we're going to be reviewing another wig from the Vibuka Fox line. And stay tuned. You're going to see the before picture. And hopefully we'll look much better and presentable on the after picture. So stay tuned. Mm -hmm. So when I tell people that I wear my hair up in ponytails under my wig, I want to literally show you. So I have an excuse my hair. It needs to be washed. I'm going to do a separate video on washing and preparing my own hair. Um, but that's another video. But I have about, I don't know, two, four, six on this side, six ponytails on this side, okay? So what I do is I take it and I literally just take those six and put it in a ponytail to make maybe just one. And I grab the others on this side. And again, excuse how my hair looks because it needs to be washed. But I grab the other side up, those six or so ponytails, and I put those into one, okay? So that's how I kind of gather them up. I'm gonna turn around so you can see it. Then I take my um, stocking cap here, place it on my head, mash the ponytails down, and tuck the ponytails under the wig cap. So that's what I mean and, and I wanted to show that to you for those of you who were wondering. There you have it. So I am wearing for you the Vivica Fox Hara wig and this is what the stock card looks like. Let me give you a 360 view of this particular wig. So I'm gonna let you see both the right, left sides and do a turnaround for you so that you can see how it looks. So here we go. come up close for you because I'm wearing the FS430 and here's how the color looks. It's gorgeous. I can see persons wearing this wig if you're going on vacation and you're going to an island and this is just a fun very playful wig. Um, I think you would definitely enjoy it. I do want to tell you that this particular wig, it feels very coarse to the touch, okay? Um, almost to the point where it feels dry. And I just didn't want you to be alarmed by that. That's just the texture of the wig. It is very textured, very, um, it's, not, um, it's not scratchy, but it's not soft either. The best way I can explain it is that it is extremely coarse. So um, it does resemble that natural, uh, for those persons who have the more textured hair, it really does resemble that. Um, so just wanted to give you an idea. Stick around for the specifications for this wig. You can see yourself wearing this wig on like a cruise or or maybe just visiting an island, comment below. Um, I think you would enjoy it, but let me know what you think. Specifications for this particular wig are as follows. So we don't have any combs anywhere in this wig, but we do have the adjustable band in the back. So you can customize the fit 
for um, your liking. Also, it does have what they call the pure stretch cap and it's supposed to lie flat on your head. Um, it is stretchable, very stretchable. And I turned it inside out, but here's how the wig actually look. The color, beautiful. This particular wig on the card stock um, information listed, it says that it is 356 degrees through 292 degrees curling iron safe. So you can curl this hair if you like. I don't know why you would. Um, you know, I think it comes with that little um, textured look for a reason. But those are the specifications for this wig. I wanna thank you all for joining me again today on Everything Beauty's YouTube channel. Check the description box for the information of where you can actually purchase this particular wig. And until next time, please take care of each other and yourself. And I'll be back next week with another video.